Welcome to Jerry Bear Reacts. Today, we're going to react to Season 2, Episode 14, the home stretch of Legacies here, entitled, There's, There's a, a Place, place Where, where the, the Lost things, things Go. That feels like something along the lines of orphans, to be honest. Uh, don't quote me on that. But it just feels like the route they could be going now to go along with that. The last episode was very good. We get the end of Kai Parker, almost the end of Dorian, the end of Sebastian. Potentially, he could have hopped into Malivore. Love triangles with Jeb and Caleb and Alyssa and MG. That's a love square, I guess. And everything in between. The darkness has returned with inside uh, Joe. Even if just for a moment there at the end, that's not the dark witch that the necromancer need. The necromancer. And Rick should have drank with the boys. And they found Raph abandoned. So I think this probably leads into Raph's stuff. You can't have that just open up in the last episode and not go into it immediately. So we'll go ahead and put Jerry behind the scenes. And we can watch episode 14. Who is this wee lad? Oh, it's Jade. Josie? God, you scared me. I'm sorry, I just wanted to make sure that you're okay. Had to brush your face real quick, girl. Oh, I was just feeling you. I guess I've just been thinking about you. Either you're dreaming or she came to yeah. break down the barrier, Actually, girl. I can't stop thinking about you. Yeah. Maturity. Crushes. I've been thinking about you, too. Ooh. Something about to go sideways. Oh. Fighting evil by him moonlight. It's a good smooch. It's past curfew. And dad's going to be so pissed. Well, what the fuck, Wednesday Adams? What are you doing around here? Was there two of you now? God bless you, cat. Uh, that uh, kind of the same kind of cinematography that was used in the uh, Stefan and Caroline smooch. Just saying. Staraline. You were having a sex dream. What? No, I wasn't. Please tell me it wasn't Landon. Or Hope, for that matter. I wasn't having a sex dream. It was a smooch Sleep. dream. Yeah. The dream was so intense, you leaked right onto your fucking nasty-ass toes. Bro, put them away. Hashtag bloop. Sometimes it feels slower than others. Am I tripping? We all carry I am. A burden. Our eyes are open to evil. Nipple. In recent to help. You will all have an important role to play in this simulation. Oh, stop looking at me like that. It'll be fun. A VR this device box. Oh. Was created by Professor Rupert Vardinus. Okay. Ew. The real Professor Vardinus. Mm. He's quite famous in mystical therapeutic circles. It's his variation so, on the Chambre de Chasse. Bring All his psychological over. concerns will be transferred inside to form a shared narrative. Now the world you create together can be anything. That from sounds pirates from the high seas to spies and the terrible. Cultural. But no matter what it ends up looking like, it will be designed specifically to help you. Yeah, yeah, and I'm out here in the cold I streets like to find him. of Chicago. But on the bright side, at least I knew where to start. Because there's one thing that everyone in Mystic Falls knows. There's a place where the lost things go. Roll credits. For the music. If I were you, I'd ask the dame who sings. Because I don't. Ten toes down, bro. Miss T. I'd like to have a quick. Somebody in there stealing something? Yep. Bro, this is like. This feels like beat for beat. In another show that we've watched, what happened? Maybe it was Lucifer? A flashback in Lucifer, maybe? With uh, Kane? Yeah. Fardless. My name is Holmes, dear boy. Oh, my Sherlock, Sherlock Holmes. 
Oh me, oh my. I don't think you were supposed to wake up. Bottle of champagne for Lizzie Saltzman. They were going up to Liz, huh? Aaron Hinton, Ed Rogers, Jeff Tarver, Diego Espinoza, Taylor Hart. Oh, no. They're being about that shitty wolf man in here, too. Someone's trying to kill you. Oh. Cigarettes hey. killed people, too. I'd never smoked a day in my life, but in that moment, I understood the urge to put your lips on something you knew was bad for you. Thank you. Bars, poetry. I'm sorry, I'm still a little... Lee quit. Yeah, there's his word. That was the end of my game. I'm not Sherlock Holmes. I'm Rupert Vardamus. And I'm not a detective. I'm a professor. Here. Is that you, Milton? I know this must be all very confusing. I remember your name from the school dossiers. I remember everything. In fact, thanks to... Bam, bam, bam. Who could it be? Gun cocking. This doesn't make any sense. You licked your last I quit. I by now. Somebody done got shoved. That was it. Barnum is locked in the locker, bro. Professor Bartimus. How? What are you that doing here? Pustule clock locked my body in here. But not before he locked my mind away in that box. For her, she's got a twin sister who left everything behind mm. to become her publicist. One that That's you, exactly Joe. how to get her back into the spotlight. Even if it means making her the target of a murderer. Murder. How am I doing so far? I think you're red hot. I don't know what you're talking about. Said the sister slash publicist to the reporter, but she was missing an important fact. They kill anyone. I don't even know how that singer got that bottle. All that matters is that she's... Like I said, Josie poisoned her sister. Accident or tried to. Accidentally or intentionally doesn't fucking matter. Dead. And putting you behind bars is the only way I'll ever pry you out of your sister's claws. Wait. Where? Don't go. I have one last drink with me. For old time's sake. Yeah, go ahead. Let's get it. Let's order some champagne, shall we? Why would you drink from her flat? You are dumber than a bag of old fucking socks that ain't Rose. been to the laundry. Maybe it's the booze talking, but I just had to see you one last time. Maybe it's the booze talking. You had a sip. You didn't kill anyone, Joe said. But it had to be me. The pieces don't fit. I know so who the pieces fit because I watched. And if one of us has to die, I'd rather it be me. Do you see that? Because you're the caretaker. You probably. Ooh, Prosecco. Presidio. Oh, shit. MG. I wanted to tell her that I saw something on that piece of paper, but it's like they say. <laughs> Dead men tell no tales. Down goes Frazier. Don't do this. I won't let you. And the plot thickens. But if it is just Lizzie murdering who gives a shit at this point? Saltzman. Don't you label me insane again, okay? I am the only person here who is in their right mind. We just need to find you your escape word. Save it for the judge. Oh, yeah, that's, that's good, MG. My name's Milton. I know. Okay, I know you as well as anyone, Milton Grayslee. She can play in his emotions, bro. I'm not bro. proud of this, but I'm kind of like your blind spot. So you you know. are so into me that you'll sort of do whatever I say. So slap those puppies on me and maybe you'll get over your block. Or we could run away together. Just maybe you and to me. Maybe to a real beach. 
to a real place. Mexico. The cops will never find us. Not there. Is this a serious offer? Hell no. But the fact that you're convinced I'm a killer and you still considered it totally proves my point. Now, Fifty Shades me. It's just, you know how fucked up it is? Like, you're so well in tuned and aware of how he feels about you that you still treat him like this? Cut that boy. Let him go. <laughs> this motherfucker got shot again, bro. Lizzie, run. Find hope. Oh, crap. Oh, Christ on a cracker. Is it just Ryan Clark? Is he back? I got Lizzie. nothing, man. Lizzie, she she got her escape word, but she's still in the game. And Josie died. I saw it. So why is she still in there? If she got her safe word and died, and she's still in there, unless it was all a ruse, it was all the dream. We're closed. Hope, Andrea, Michael Smith. Oh. Yeah, I know you don't play up here, right? Because y'all going. Oh my goodness. Look at look at that look. What is it? What is it? You you can go up there if you want. I thought they were about to because they like to wrestle at nighttime. Go on, go up there. I ain't gonna stop you. That's your spot. Here, I gotta fix the thing for you though. Get it? Hello, sister. So Hello, shocked. brother. One of us was always going to become a killer. I ain't a killer, but don't push me. Because of the merch. Yo. That's what this whole thing has been about. Yes, it is. I made it that way. So I pulled this trigger, and your mind is stuck here while your body waits for me to absorb it during the merge in the real world. Josie, please. God dang. I, I know I don't do a good job of showing it, but I love you even more than I love myself. So much so don't more. Do it. Don't even do it. Don't Sorry, do it. Sis. It's you or me. Forget the bullshit and remember me. And there's no fighting fate. How about you fight me instead? A shot was gunned. And down goes Frazier. It was Hope Michelson saving the day yet again. Yeah, she's a hero at the end of the day. Such a hope, Lily. There's her word, Fatimus. Let me guess. You're seeing a word right now. You good kitty. Yeah. Now, um, what are we gonna do about Joe? Leave her ass there until the merge. I'm just kidding. I don't mean that. When things are good with me, I don't give you the time of day. MG, brother, I've been there. Let it go. On to the next, on, on to the next. So you're taking Dorian, too, fresh out the hospital after his almost death? Y'all married gonna go live happy ever after? Who's, who's Rick's that kid gonna be? I thought this was, uh, see you soon. Oh, goodbye. That's a very good closing the door on Dorian and Emma, if that's the case. Oh my goodness, that was a big yawn. If that's the case, that's a good way to close the door on them. It's because they, they got out the game. I don't think that'll be the end of them, but those are very two really good supporting characters. I don't want to see it go anywhere yet. <laughs> Called that shit, didn't we? Then again, it's one thing that really made sense. You okay, girl? Sorry. <laughs> Just looking at his nipples and his body us? mirror. What if what the game was trying to teach me is that something will always come between me and Rip? I don't think so. Some impossible choice that I'm going to have to make. Then choose him. It's like good. I said in the bar. I you... did. I did. And it felt good. It felt right. But it wasn't right. Because if I got onto that bus, I wouldn't have gotten out of the game. 
I didn't get to leave until I chose someone over him. Was that my lesson? That, that seemed, no matter. Seems like a dumbass lesson, though, if we're being honest. How much I want him. Here comes Tuesday Eve. It's a double entendre, by the way. Why am I locked up exactly? Oh, you've been through Boop. a lot. You're right. It's not. It is now. I mean, she looks like she would have been in The Purge or some breakfast morning okay, used to it. murder commercial. Tuesday Eve. This book is here to stay. Josie, it's okay. I'm just gonna. Do you get it? Wednesday Adams. Tuesday Eve. I'm gonna put you back to sleep until we can figure out what's going on, okay? Every super squad needs a super villain. Hey, 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 hey. I'll cry chop shit out of you. You definitely get absorbed now. Attend. And just like that, she changed the season to autumn. Ain't that crazy? Hashtag bloop. I mean, that's such a fucking, I mean, that episode felt, brother, I don't even know. I, remember the... I don't know what's, what's, my brain itches. Hold on here. Let me get the blurb real quick. Uh, to cope with recent traumas, the students enter a simulation to take them to the film noir world and forces them to confront their conflict. That, it wasn't for me. As cool as those scenarios are, like a who did it, flashbacks, tra time traveling. Dean did one. We saw flashbacks to Cain back in the day. And Lucifer, Supernatural, etc., etc. It's just like, as much as it fits the flow of how off put or off shoot, maybe the word I'm looking for if this show is, it didn't, it didn't fit the bill for me. I don't know. Personally, they had some good moments there. Good teaching lessons. I'm not fully buying into the Joe thing yet. Not fully, like a little bit of it's there. But like you, all that property damage you just did to the Salvatore school, fucking hateful. She went up from the bottom, but didn't shoot out the top. And then the whole school exploded in fire and she walked out the front door. I'm confused on the, on the path that she took. Is everybody else dead in the school? Now I know the necromancer's pulling the strings. I'm not dumb. It's just, meh, I guess. I don't know. I'll look forward to the last two episodes. I'm not, this isn't a full just snooze fest, but it just wasn't for me. Season two, episode 14 is a place where the lost things go. Season two, episode 15, life was so much easier when I only cared about myself. Links and everything will be in the description box down below. Playlist will be up on screen. As always, stay cute, stay hydrated. I'll catch you on the next one.